be cold outside today, but for nine Tifton volunteers, it was freezing as they slid into a cold pool for this year's Polar Plunge event. WALB News 10's Lena Allen was there and shares how this chilling event helps the community each year. Oh. Every plunge, oh. splash, <laughs> and shiver <laughs> came with the generosity and goodwill that will be spread during the first day of the year. You know, they say what you do on New Year's Day is kind of how the rest of the year goes, and so it's nice to raise money for uh, a needy cause. The annual Tift Area YMCA Polar Plunge gathers volunteers who compete to raise money for a chosen organization or nonprofit. At the end of the fundraising efforts, each volunteer braves a frigid plunge into a cold pool of water, 54.5 degrees to be exact. It uh, wakes you up, <laughs> it gets you going, but uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty stimulating. This year, nine volunteers raised $15,530, with $12,000 of those funds going back into organizations throughout the community. Sam Wright was this year's winner, raising over $8,000 for his organization, Brother Charlie's Rescue Center. The organization supports homeless men 18 years or older who may have a disability. We're more of a uh, uh, hand up instead of a hand out, so we want to get our men back to the workforce within a reasonable amount of time. Brett Ragenhurst has been participating in the Polar Plunge since it started in 2013. He says it's not only about raising money for organizations in need, but also spreading awareness about each one. Well, there's so many uh, needs in the community, and I think a lot of people aren't aware of um, so many of our nonprofits, and this just helps bring awareness. So it may be a chilling situation for some, but for others, it's a big boost into 2024. Just to help other people make a difference in our community. Well, what a fun way to start off the new year. Event organizers and participants tell me they hope this event gets bigger and bigger each year so that more organizations can be supported throughout Tifton. Well, I'm going to go ahead and plunge into the new year with them. Lena Allen, WALB, your hometown news source. Woo!